Two Phoenix police officers out of the hospital recovering after police say a man intentionally drove his car right into those officers right there. This video I'm sure you've seen by now. This happening Tuesday morning. Well, today, some students at a South Phoenix school, they spent some time in the classroom working on get well cards for those injured officers. And Marcy Jones joins us live with their get well wishes tonight. Marcy, this is so nice. It is, and I can't help but smile so big tonight, Carrie. My heart is so full after being with these wonderful little people. Now, normally in something like this, it's the adults or the teacher's idea to hand out cards, but she said it was actually the children that came to her after they either saw that horrific video that we've all seen now or if they just heard about it talking on the street. And she said that they wanted to take action. They protected our community from bad people. And so uh, it makes me feel safe at night. When you heard what happened to these officers, what did you think? I thought, like, no, I just don't sad. When this fourth grade class heard three Phoenix police officers were mowed over by a car Tuesday morning, they wanted to let them know how much they cared. Handwritten cards were the answer. I'm sorry for the accident. I was going to say get well soon. Many sent well wishes and words of encouragement. Thank you for protecting our community and um, keep believing and don't give up. Get well soon. Keep up and and don't worry about what happened. Just do your work. Some dug a little deeper. Teacher Nubia Ruiz says even she was touched by the heartfelt messages. He said, keep healing. And I said, well, what do you mean by keep healing? And he said, well, I don't mean physical. He said, because your bones break and then you heal. I mean, they want to go back and do their job. You know, healing isn't just about you getting better physically, but it's about wanting to continue doing what you love. And even though they may have a lot to learn, these fourth graders get an A-plus in compassion. If I seen them walking, I would just jump drop my backpack and run up to them and give them a hug. I don't care. I don't know them. About 50 of those beautiful cards will be distributed to those officers who are thankfully home now. And it is a surprise. So officers, if you are watching, get well soon and act surprised. Reporting live, Marcy Jones, Fox 10 News.